welcome. Hi, guys. A uh, little better quality camera now, hopefully, uh, and I'll ignore that ever happened on the James Felton Show. I appreciate those who tuned into that and who uh, any new subscribers that came from that video. I really do appreciate you. Thank you so much for coming. Uh, today I'm going to go through uh, protocol and I'm going to take you to the website in just a second. Uh, I just wanted to have a quick discussion and hopefully my, f uh, the website's way prettier than I am, but anyways, I'll uh, just make this quick. Uh, I think a lot of people are getting wrecked right now. There's still protocols that are failing, unfortunately, uh, and it's going to continue. Uh, you're going to want to get in, get out quick if you're making any degen plays. And if you are, have an opportunity and have some extra cash flow that you could maybe bet on the future with, I think there's this product that I'm about to show you is got some great opportunities. Uh, I think a lot of people should be spreading out their their wealth or their their disposable income that they have in DeFi into varying degrees of risk. And I think this one takes away a lot of risk factors. It's got a lot of real revenue sources uh, that are really the only way these revenue sources are going away is if all blockchains close down. They're going to be diversified across different blockchains. And so let's go and take a little deeper dive. And this brings us to Bourbon on Blockchain. Bourbon on Blockchain Services is a membership-based club dedicated to supporting and strengthening blockchain technology. Um, so the big thing here is they're going to diversify in different validator nodes, uh, as well as staking options uh, to basically help make the networks that they're on more secure, uh, more easier access, faster, all those kind of things by by taking on these. So we're going to take a little look at the website. I don't think I'm going to go through the docs. Uh, those are pretty easy for you guys to go through. Uh, this website really deserves all the attention, uh, as you'll see as I go forward and as you can just see already from this first uh, loading screen with the bottles kind of flying around there. I am a bourbon fan, full disclosure, um, so this one did attract me that way. Uh, but as I said, as you'll see as we go through the benefits and the systems and how this is all set up uh, I really do think it's a great way and if we could bring as many people into this one uh, it, it would be nice to have ourselves focused as a DeFi community because we are pretty small right now uh, there's very limited money inside DeFi right now and if we can direct ourselves in a in a direction that's positive and growth oriented we can all win to be honest with you by having these funds pooled and this is a great project I think for that uh, unfortunately there's so many projects out there we're all spread so thin I don't know that I'm magically going to change everybody's mind and make them understand this uh, but if you do and you pass that on, you pass that on. There's some value to that. Uh, and again, not financial advice and 450 to 500 and some dollars, as you'll see uh, with the NFE mint prices is also not for everybody. But if as many people as possible buy one, two, or more if they have it, uh, NFTs, and we get some good money funneled into this, uh, it's going to generate some pretty good DeFi income for everybody involved and help us uh, grow some bags pretty darn quickly. Uh, and the nice thing too is as we go into the bear market, uh, the bull market, if we're diversified in a bunch of different um, validator nodes in a bunch of different chains, uh, if one doesn't succeed and the other five do, and I think there's a good chance that most chains will succeed, especially the one, the core ones, uh, then it's just going to be a pretty darn nice jump up in X's uh, potential there. So uh, let's have a look at this very, very gorgeous website, and I hope you'll agree when you go through it. Uh, even if you're not a, a whiskey or bourbon fan, you might find some value to how this is laid out and just how uh, uh, very, very good and very quality built this this is uh, and definitely nice to see that it's not some 8-bit not that I mind 8-bit sometimes but it's not some kind of degen looking website with little wisps of water ripples going everywhere um, so let's have a peek there that wasn't a slight on anybody uh, bird on blockchain service let's for, scroll down a little bit um, as you can see it tells me to scroll down uh, some trust some people that they're trusted by I know there is some ownership of and I think we'll see it later of a distillery which is kind of cool um, so the ecosystem, premier NFT assets uh, protocol that resides on the Polygon network. So the NFTs themselves are on the Polygon network. And it's all, this whole thing is dedicated to strengthening the blockchain technology by operating and maintaining validator nodes and other integral, integral support structures, can't speak, uh, in the interest of contributing to a greater good of the cryptocurrency ecosystem while increasing overall reliability and functionality. So a lot of the things they're investing in are real assets and real revenue generators on the blockchain. And they're the core foundations of any blockchain. These will be all uh, proof of stake, not proof of work. Uh, proof of work definitely is, there's a lot of value. Uh, Kadena, I'm getting a lot of, I'm getting some exposure there through a great project. Um, but this one here is going to focus only on proof of stake, probably mostly because there's a lot of 
uh, equipment and stuff, extra equipment and stuff that goes into the others and a totally different skill set. So by focusing on one, it lets them do that one really, really well. Um, so let's scroll down a little more. Unique 3D entities. Now, these are definitely attracted me to this. And what you'll see as we go through the website, these are actually computer generated. These are not photos. Uh, and so, which is pretty amazing and pretty neat. And he's done all these up. So there's five different bottles, four glasses, two cigars. So these are the varying types of NFTs you can unlock. Uh, animals, tabletops, and backgrounds. The animals are actually like toppers on top of the cork kind of thing, which is pretty cool. And a few little examples there. And rewards and redistribution protocol. Uh, so the club will be uh, contributing treasury assets into various essential blockchain platforms, cr uh, critically critical cryptocurrency infrastructure, and alternative forms of blockchain services. More spe uh, specifically, BNBs will be strengthening cryptocurrency infrastructures such as blockchain validators, nodes, master nodes, blockchain nodes, lending protocols, and on-chain staking and staking pools. Uh, so to learn more, you can go into there. Uh, as you can see, there's quite a few chains that they're planning on going on. I'm sure that will evolve as time goes on, depending on what uh, things become more bullish or less bullish than others. And based on the funds that are available in the, in the treasury as well. And as you can see here, what this is all talking about is there is no set 1%, 2%. There's no set rewards for the monthly uh, thing. There's no average, well, there will be an average at some point as time goes on and as they have some proof, but for full transparency, there is no average right now. There is no guaranteed income on this. It's just gonna be based on the investments they make and the real revenue they get from those investments. So that is just, mwah. Um, so really want, really love that and really gives me some great uh, insight into what they're doing and how they're trying to do it. Uh, so the, one of the things they're doing is validate strengthening blockchain technology through node validations, delegations, and on-chain staking. So by doing these things, it helps decentralize, uh, the blockchain helps create more security, uh, and more, um, ability for it not to be taken over by a centralized source, uh, verify, uh, so access reports, treasury balance and club portfolio. So they're going to have all kinds of transparency systems in place to make sure we can see how the money is flowing through the project and flowing into our hands. Uh, and then obviously a claim using your members, you can, uh, as club members can claim. Uh, one thing to mention, I think it'll show it anyways, but just in case it is a $1 per month. And if you do not uh, pay your monthly fee for three months, uh, you then lose all those rewards that you've accumulated. And then on top of that, any accumulation that happens after that does not, it, it can, it, discontinues from accumulating rewards. So it'll stop accumulating, accumulating any rewards if you stop for three months until you pay your month again. So do keep that in mind. Do be careful. Um, so it does want some type of ownership, some type of returning to the protocol, coming into the discord, being interactive, being part of votes. Like it's just, it's helps keeps this, it helps keep this project top of mind, which is great. So now going on to the rewards. So allocated redistribution. So as you can see, there's a little pie chart here, but just specifically, we can go through it right here. 50% is redistributed to holders every month, equally distributed among the 10,000, real yield rewards, transparent reports. 45% is going to the club portfolio. This is added, uh, helps add to existing validators, delegation and staking pro positions and develop new club portfolio positions voted on by the club members. This can even include off chain stuff as well. So there's some neat things that are looking at doing there, which is pretty cool as well. And then 5% into team compensation. This will include ongoing uh, operations and maintenance of the, of the protocol and of the products and services that they're offering and continued acquisition of computer hardware and other protocol equipment that they need. So their servers actually are not going to be VPS virtual servers. They're actually going to have their own servers set up that are running all of this stuff and maintained and uh, which gives definitely some speed throughputs, other benefits, uh, but does take some team uh, constant supervision and, and help with that. So uh, roadmap, I'm not going to go through the roadmap. Uh, a lot of the roadmap going forward is going to be dependent on how quickly they mint out and what different validators and different places are going to be able to invest that money. And that's going to really depend on all of us and whether we choose this as a protocol we want to invest in. And so just a couple little things here. So mint price, 500 USDC. Blockchain Willie Mint on is on Polygon. Um, and then when is mint date? So 25th. So today is the, uh, minting, uh, possibly by the video time, the video comes out after I edit it, it may be already tomorrow. 
Uh, and then 26 will be for the OGs. So some people have already kind of, I think there was 300 NFTs that were already pre-minted by some other holders to help build the treasury and, or build the liquidity pool. I'm not sure exactly, but basically to start it off. And uh, they got OG status, I think those, or it might've been another way, I apologize. I don't really know how the OGs got their, their status. Uh, and then public mint starts on November, November 27th. The whitelist is that secure mint that I just mentioned. So this guy here, the secure mint spots will, uh, 100,002 will be available. And minting is done on the website as a transaction on the Polygon network. And just a quick little blurb here. So by holding the BNBS NFT, you will receive access to the Bourbon and Blockchains Club. The club membership provides access to crypto education and earns rewards from supporting blockchain infrastructure via validator nodes, master nodes, and other blockchain support opportunities. In addition to Bourbon and Blockchain Club has partnered with a bourbon distillery with hopes of providing off-chain opportunities exclusive to NFT holders. So being a bourbon guy, this kind of excites me. Uh, I'd love to sometime go down there and visit the, the bourbon uh, uh, distillery and uh, possibly even meet the team and stuff. I think they're talking about some events and stuff like that, which will be pretty cool. Uh, so what can you do? Join the Discord right up at the top there and also right down the bottom here. Uh, I think that's pretty important. If you're th even thinking about this, get in there, have a chat with them, uh, do a little more research. Uh, Paul Dutton did a great video on this. Uh, I did appreciate some of his insight and he was far more succinct than sometimes I am. So uh, definitely give him a look if you have a chance. And then Twitter and YouTube. Uh, other than that, we're going to go NFT collection for a quick second, and then we're going to go mint mine. I'm pretty excited. I want to see what I get. And <laughs> this is cool. I forgot that this was like this. So uh, just a neat little kind of look around, take a peek. Um, so Bourbon Blockchain Services, reward membership-based uh, based club dedicated to supporting and strengthening the blockchain technology. Um, oh, this is pretty cool. So this is actually showing you. So he actually did wireframes and then literally built out these 3D images uh, by hand. So there is a video I believe you can watch uh, down here or in the Discord uh, that actually goes through kind of a uh, sped up version of him actually going through and making all the edits and changing everything around. Uh, really, really neat. I took a quick peek at it. Uh, I was pretty impressed. And as you can see, it's turned into quite the nice product. Uh, where quality and utility comes together. So uh, the NFT obviously spared no expense. Their website, they obviously did a really good job of. Uh, so really just kind of showing that premier quality for their for all their stuff, that which bleeds through to their um, to their NFTs and then to what they're going to be doing in the back end and where the real utility happens. Uh, so proposed uh, purpose of the DNF NFTs is tokenize the, the club membership. So just to give the, the way of everything to flow. So it gives your percentage ownership and then in turn gives you tokens out. Mint and secondary markets for safety and security. So uh, this is pretty cool too. So they got a 10, uh, OpenSea I believe is where they can be sold. Uh, there'll be a 10% royalty when you sell them and 50% of that will go to the team and 50% of the goal will go to um, doing other things with it, like uh, fixing systems and upgrading computers and all that kind of stuff. So it's just an added little revenue source for the, uh, the, the basically the base of the whole project. Uh, and then votes will be done uh, when needed and support blockchain claims and rewards. So just to set up for the thing. And like I said, here's the NFTs, these gorgeous little guys. Um, there is different levels, but the levels do not affect anything. They're just there for fun. Um, there is no, you make more money off of this one. You make more money off of that one, which I also thought was really, really great of them. Uh, it's really just a nice looking picture and the ability for you to, um, have the NFT and just look, look super, super awesome. Uh, and all these bottles, glasses, cigars, pipes, animals, the animals are the toppers sometimes on top of them. So, so really cool. Uh, do, 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 do. economy of overview. So we already went through that. Oh, here's the milestones. Okay. So, uh, they're going to give some minting milestones, which is pretty cool. So there's 19 milestones and six secure mints. So two NFT, so they're going to be giving away NFTs at different milestones as they sell through. So as you can see, as they go through each kind of 500 ish or whatever are giving some extra, uh, mints on top of as giveaways and these mints were purchased. So they're not going to be affecting the protocol and diluting the, the rewards that we get. Um, cause they've all been purchased. All right, let's meet the team. So we got Mr. Maverick, uh, founder, PR and marketing, Grant Matic, founder, marketing and strategic planning, uh, generator, community manager, and social media. 
uh, and Dreco. Uh, Dreco was actually, I believe, the one that is part of Cryptonairs. Uh, so he um, was part of a protocol that basically, a, a Discord that basically uh, looked into product, projects, did deep dives into projects, helped educate community, their community, uh, and just uh, so a lot of knowledge and, and base around different crypto projects, what works, what doesn't work. So uh, it's great to have this kind of well-rounded team. And this one, actually, I didn't realize until now. Uh, so Stephen the advise, is an advisor, and he's the calculator guy. Um, if you ever get a chance to, actually, I'll give him a quick plug. Um, he's got a Discord. Uh, really, really smart guy, and uh, they do a lot of different ways to invest, including something called Delta Neutral. Uh, you can learn all these different skills and tips on his Discord. It is a paid Discord, uh, but I think it holds a lot of value. Uh, I actually am in there. I haven't had a chance to look around as deeply as I'd like to, um, but it definitely has a lot of different techniques and things that I don't think people are realizing is available, uh, possibly with minorly less returns, but a lot safer and more uh, productive way to not risk risk your money. Uh, Delta dual neutral basically means you can't really lose with the strategies. Obviously, anything can happen. Um, so I definitely think he's worth a little look into. So definitely grab his Twitter and maybe uh, look him up. Um, so two designers, four developers, and three advisors. Uh, so a strong team behind them. So that's great. And we already did all th through those. Uh, so I think that's about it for now. Let's head over to Mint. Pretty excited for this. So let's uh, connect. I do wish I could do a little more, but I'm going to have to just do one for now. Oh, let me pause for a moment. All right, so just connecting. And usually that would pop up, but I think because I was putting my password in. Connect, and I believe this. All right, so let's close that up. All right, so now that we're all connected, let's go mint now and then read through all of this, as I'm sure you all will. And never just skip through it all and just hit confirm without reading because that is bad and voila so the first one looks like it's probably a confirm one just to kind of approve the transact the contract and i'm on my ledger if you don't have a ledger please get one there'll be a link in the description that i think gives i don't think it gives you a discount unfortunately i think it just gives me uh, discount on future ones that I buy, which I would probably give away to my community and stuff. So if you wanted to use that, great. And voila, I got a pipe. I like the idea of a pipe. I think I like that that uh, bottle. And the background actually looks pretty neat. I don't think I've seen that one. All right, so I had to go to OpenSea to pull it up so I could see it in its glory. Assuming that'll make it nice and big. Come on. There we go. Look at that. I actually really like that one. I would have liked an animal on there, but I'll survive. And I did want the uh, golf, but I kind of like the little background there and the glass and the pipe. Awesome. Well, exciting. So I, I, I'm definitely going to try and get a few more of these, I think. Uh, we'll see how things go and how cash flow works, whatever. But um, do please like and subscribe, as I mentioned before. Uh, and if you do have a time, please do check out the Discord and go have a chat with the team. Uh, and do a little more research. If this excites you at all or gives you any kind of, hey, maybe this is something that uh, I want to do instead of all the GGN moves, uh, then please, please, please take, a, take your time, have a peek, and go from there. Not financial advice. And uh, thanks again, guys. I'm really appreciating this journey. I'm so happy to be on camera and be able to show off to you and say hi to you guys. Um, I look forward to hopefully doing some AMAs. If you're interested in AMAs, please put some comments in there. Uh, and if there's projects you want to see, if you have projects that you think are kind of underdogs that are not getting visualized as much as they should, I'd really love to be introduced to their teams. So don't hesitate to, to look at me for that. Um, and uh, yeah, let's let's have some fun and let's learn up, learn some projects and, and really find some places to spread our money out in responsible ways, hopefully. Um, every so often I'm going to do GGN moves. Uh, that's the, like, I do enjoy those sometimes and I have some risk capital I'm building that to do that. Um, but I also like to find some things that are going to be, uh, safe, secure, uh, safe, safe, quote unquote, um, opportunities for us to hopefully, uh, make some long-term money out of it. Um, cause this really could be around for, for a long, long time. So thanks again so much for joining and I do appreciate all you guys and, uh, have yourselves a wonderful day.